Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to my channel, Alisa Tropical Fruit Tree. So today the video is about my custard apple guy. Just would like to show you. Um, I'm going to do uh, my hand pollinate. So which is uh for my custard apple, uh, Pakistan prefix and African pride. And just want to show you after one week and some is two week when I do a hand pollinate. It's some excesses, so some is already start holding the fruit, guys. You can see the shape of the fruit. So this my first one is uh, my custard apple, Pakistan prefix, been like two and a half years old in the ground. And the trunk down here, it's very big. And they are like a very bushy, and I just prune a lot of early, uh, like a spring time, guy. But then they are grow back, and this one I try to uh, do hand pollinate as well. But I haven't seen any yet. Said proper one, just a very uh, where is it? A uh, very little because the flower getting dry, guy. Normally they said this one uh, self pollinate. And I just want to show you the different uh, male and female, okay? So, yeah, so this is a female. It's very hardly guy, because the weather is uh, warm, sometimes very warm, sometimes it's very cold. And they are, um, come a different time male and female. So at the moment, we don't have any, uh, Males only female guy, even also this one also female on my discussed apple. So this one I do hand pollinate. You can't see yet, but yeah. And there's a female, it's a lot of female guy, not my male at all. So that female. Yeah. That's a female. This is a female. <laughs> And yeah, just want to show you, um, after one week, I do hand pollinate summer tree, the uh, sexy. E example, this one. There's a one, this is like a 10 days old hand pollinate, guys. So, see, it's different. And this one is only a few days ago we do hand pollinate. And I will show you how the male and the female in between the look like, guys. <clears throat> Okay, so this is uh, the male, that's how it look like. See, that's the, the petal was open like that. That's the male. So we're going to collect them. And also this one. So they be, this uh, uh, is the male. And I'm looking for the female to show you guys. I'm not sure what I have because this morning was a female. And I have no pollen to... Uh, Pollinate, or oh, that's all the become a male now. Yeah, so many male open now. Here we go. Male, a lot of male. Guys, okay, so he is a female. Okay, that's a female and next door is a male. So very different. Oh, look at the fruit guy, this two weeks old. So this is my cassa uh, apple packs and prolific. That's two weeks old guy. Two weeks or ten day here. Eh? Looks very big. Look at that. Nice. See that's the shape of the fruit is two weeks old. Very nice. Oh, this one looks so big. That's amazing. Look at that. And here it is. Oh, and look at that. This one, and also this one. And there's a broom here too. Here you go. See the fruit getting bigger now. Guys, so the two weeks old, I've been doing a hand pollinate. Here you go. My custard apple are uh, packs and prolific. Tree not as very big. Oops, sorry. So the tree is not very big, guys. That's a mile also. I'm going to collect the pollen now. And this also is a female, guys. So they start open a little bit. When they, they open all the way up, that is a mile. So this is a female, guys. 
a week ago i gave them a hand pollinate so i feel like the fruit start setting guy on my little tree you look closer so there's a one week old look like a castle apple brook uh pakistan prefix it starts setting the fruit which is a very exciting guy and so many here we go so this has been one week old and they set many fruit in this one it's like around 10 10 plus fruit in here and look at that so nice right so this is my custard apple and even down here it's hard to see they said if they set the fruit you will see the shape of the fruit if they don't say they will get dry off so i see the fruit sky like the shape of the fruit so we just will be maybe hold it and this one i can tell that's exactly that's a fruit shape that's amazing so in this one is around 20 fruit all up but i don't know how long they're going to uh, hold it okay and even my applicant pride i do one week ago too and they start set the fruit and the tree very small guy you look at see that my custard apple that's very small and i do a hand pollinate and that's the shape of the fruit as well right so which is a very exciting guy in future to show you how fruit can handle or not otherwise that's the working because last last year i do nothing with the custard apple so no fruit okay so that's a female i'm going to got a I got the the pollen, so I'm going to pollinate my uh, castor apple in here, guys. It's a bit hard. Alright, guys, so this is my uh, female. They start open a little bit, so I'm going to give them a pollinate. So, what is it? So, easy, you just open them a little bit. Come on, come this way. So. Here we go, open a little bit and then there's a uh, pollen. Maybe I grab a little bit more pollen. So I collect all the mail here, the pollen. And you just mix it up, guys. Like that, there's a lot of pollen, right? In here, so you just mix it up. Take a pollen and then you open the flower when it's out open a little bit and then you tuck the inside here see the inside of the castle apple in there see that one the white part here so we just take the brass and put it in touching that one then then you screw around one round and then that's it you hold it and then push so when you're done make sure you put break this off so you know that you already done a pollinate so don't need to do it again all right so i'm going to do one more here okay so here one more i see the this is a female again guy here so i'm going to keep them up uh, this one as well so hopefully it's working guy i've been researching in the youtube that's how you do no need to wrap hard just do one round scroll it and then that's it done <laughs> yeah that's all we do guys Hi guys, so I'm going to collect uh, pollen from the um, male. So that's how the male look like. You see the, the uh, petal, they open it. And you can see through inside and see so many pollen in it. So I'm going to collect them, the pollen. Okay, so I got some con container and with a brass. So I'm going to uh, collect them because I have some... No, oh, I just break the flower. Easier. Oh, here we go. So here it is. Going to put in here. Oh, don't want to waste it, guy. <laughs> so there's a one mile of flower, guys. So that's pollen we get for like that much. Okay. And I'm going to uh, I'm going to uh, pollinate my uh, eye, eye, oh, sorry, eye, and pollinate. I, I found one uh, 
three miles before. Oh, here it is. So here's a three mile. You can see what's the difference. So the pedal is the open, but it's not big open, okay? So that's the pedal. Yeah, uh, I'm going to make this take a pollinate pollen flower and mix it up like that then it's got in a brush and I just uh, can you see the white one inside so make sure you put them in the middle then after you just fit the brush a little bit one row and that's it and you pull out the flower so you so this uh, for um, remember when you see the petal is half missing, that's mean you already done a pollinate. 